The Muskogee Creek Nation hosted its inaugural Opioid Crisis Summit today to educate as many Oklahomans as possible. According to the CDC, Oklahoma is in the top 20% for drug overdose deaths. The summit's attendance included tribal members as well as federal and state representatives. The purpose was for education and training so they can bring information back to their communities. Surgeon General Lance Fry with the Muskogee Creek Nation says more people need to recognize and understand addiction and overdose to make a difference. It is a crisis. It's a, it's a epidemic that's going on in our country right now and we all need to get together and work together on it because it's going to take all of us. One demographic getting hit harder and faster than most in Oklahoma, the youth. Two News Oklahoma senior reporter Justin Ayer went to that summit and found out what health officials want parents to be aware of. It comes from peer pressure. They see other kids doing it, say, so, oh, why don't you give it a try, you know? Yeah, make it feel good. But in reality, drugs, specifically opioids, are killing Oklahoma's youth. According to the Oklahoma State Department of Health, fentanyl was involved in nearly half of opioid-related deaths, compared to 10 and 20% prior to 2020. These young people are so easily impressed and misled. It's why Ella Coleman went to Monday's summit. She feels it's incumbent upon adults to be educated about it. It's up to us, incumbent upon us, to say, hey, wait a minute. You don't realize what you're doing here. Just last week, we told you. Continuing coverage tonight after two Weber's Falls students were hospitalized this morning after an apparent drug overdose. Although adults and children are at risk, Lieutenant Commander Sam Hubbler with the U.S. Public Health Service says it can be prescription drugs or counterfeit. We see it younger and younger because access is bigger. And it's easy to get. Health officials with the Creek Nation put together this board here at the summit, showing just how much of a specific drug it takes to kill somebody. As you can see, it does not take much. Cocaine, 1,200 milligrams. Heroin, 500 milligrams. Meth, 200 milligrams. And fentanyl, just two milligrams. He urges everyone, parents, teachers, co-workers, to carry Narcan and learn how to use it. Narcan is an easy-to-use nasal spray that can counteract opioid overdoses. Do you foresee the problem getting worse? I foresee the problem getting worse before it gets better. Justin Ayer, 2 News, Oklahoma.